Okay, Bob. Yep. Thank you. Oh my god, that conference call was awful. I spent the entire last half an hour starving, dreaming about the leftover sushi I brought for lunch. Oh, you guys went out for sushi last night? Where did you go, Sakatumi or Azumi? Azumi. Mm. So good. Mm. Trying to make it for Indian food last Ooh, night. Ooh, where'd you go? Mm -hmm. uh, Bombay Sweets. Oh, yum. Mm, delicious. Tim and I uh, had ethnic food last night, too. Really? Really? <laughs> yeah, yeah, we went to Pizza Hut on the corner. Italian. It's my favorite. They have a new stuffed crust pizza. I don't know if you've heard of it. Um, it has cheese in the crust. It's really exciting. Wow. Have you been diagnosed with suburbanitis after moving out of the city? Hey Melissa, why don't you come out for drinks with Stacy and I after work today? That's a great idea. We haven't done that since you moved to New Berlin. Oh ladies, I don't know. It's Friday. TGI Friday night, you know. Me curl up on the couch with you. Has someone you love become enamored with chain restaurants and perfect lawns after relocating to the suburbs? I'm sorry, but ever since you moved to New Berlin, you're just not cool anymore. Stacy and I have been doing a little bit of internet research, and we think we, that we've found something that'll help you. What's that? Maybe you should consider Urbanadrine. What's Urbanadrine? It's a prescription medication for people like you who live in the suburbs. Hmm. Urbanadrine. Urbanadrine is a mildly sedating, non-habit-forming hallucinogenic which is FDA approved to treat the symptoms of suburbanitis. It is designed to enhance the drive for urban experiences in a convenient, once daily pill. Side effects are mild and may include nausea, vomiting and headache in the morning, the desire to use public transportation, the ability to parallel park, reading, a craving for movies with subtitles, increased enjoyment of local music, the urge to buy produce from local farmers and eat organic, thinking, and walking 10 blocks just to enjoy a baguette. Clinical studies have shown Urbanadrine does not improve your rollerblading skills or your ability to impress the opposite sex. Any changes in these functions are purely coincidental. So I'm thinking I might try this twisted sock. Mm, that looks really good. It's really good. I had it last week. Hey, ladies. Oh, my gosh. This is back downtown. Or is someone taking Urbanadrine? Once daily! <laughs> if you think Urbanadrine is right for you or someone you love, contact your doctor, pharmacist, or Carl on the corner of Farwell and North for more information. Code word, balsamic. Urbanadrine. Welcome back.